this box was super heavy. They're actually inside. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm about to go dumpster diving. I'm feeling super hopeful today, so let's see what we can find. But as always, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you enjoy my videos, leave me a like. It helps me out so, so much. And also leave a comment down below and let me know where you want to see me go next. But before we get started, I did want to thank today's sponsor, Timu. I love a good deal and I know you guys do too. Especially with the holidays coming up, I've been looking for ways to save money while I'm shopping for my friends and family. But right now, Timu has a site-wide sale of up to 90% off. So you can get a little bit for everyone and spend way less than you would on other websites or in stores. You can also use my code DKH5365 to get an extra 30% off. So I got all of this and this for less than $200. A few of my favorite items, I bought these cow slippers and this cow blanket. They're so soft, the quality is amazing, and they're less than $10 each. I also bought this, which is a makeup skincare organizer. It's huge and it has so many different drawers. It fits everything I need it to, and it was only $23. I feel like I've been losing all of my socks lately, so I bought this huge pack. It was less than $10, and the colors are so cute. They also have a ton of Christmas stuff out. I'm gonna set these up, and I'll show you guys what they look like. Here's the reindeer. They are so cute, and then these have to go a little bit higher, but I am obsessed. I even got some stuff for my dog. I got her this super cute pig dog toy. She's obsessed with it. I'm only halfway through this bag. There's so much left, but I wanted to show you my favorite things that I bought. But if you're interested in saving some money and getting some really cool things for yourself or an early start for holiday shopping, download the Timu app. The link is in my description. The app offers a super smooth shopping experience as well as some amazing perks. Okay, so I'm checking my Five Below dumpster and there's a bag here and it looks like it's full of a ton of maybe Halloween stuff in here. I kind of ripped it open. There might be another one there. So I'm gonna try and grab these out. It is super heavy, so I'm afraid it's gonna break. There's a bunch of water there, so it might be a little bit wet as well. I just grabbed the bag out and it is so heavy and full. There's a couple of these trees in there as well, so they look a little bit broken, but I'm gonna grab them anyway. I'm back home now. I got the bag with me. The whole thing's falling apart. It's so heavy, but I'm so excited. I'm just gonna start going through it. There's already a bunch of stuff on top. Uh, it looks like some candy as well. This is so cute. There's a box full of these squishy toys. They have like little faces and they're still sealed. Oh, this is so cool. There's also some beauty items in here. There's a set, $15. And then I also found a body scrub. There's also some dog clothes, which that's adorable. This one says, hello pumpkin. And then these are some pajama pants. <gasps> these are so pretty. There's a couple of iPhone cases. And this is really cool. This was $20. It's like a little mini arcade game. Here's everything I found, just a quick overview, but for the most part, this is all new. A lot of it just had like damaged boxes, but that's crazy. There's so much really cool stuff here today. Definitely a huge jackpot. These iPhone cases are so pretty. They're just like... I also found some headphones in the back, and then I showed you the arcade, but that is so cool. I can't get over it. Some cute stuff, and then some more electronic and phone accessories. And I also love these dog outfits. I also found this one. It's a little bit late for Halloween, but I'm gonna save it for next year. But this bag was a lot of fun to go through. I'm so glad they didn't really destroy anything. Usually they do. So this was definitely a pretty cool jackpot from Five Below. Okay, it's a couple hours later and I came back because I was in the area again, but there's a ton of posters in here. like. This is insane. There's a bunch of them on this side. It goes like all the way down. And then there's a ton over there. It looks like they did take a few out and like crumble them up and destroy them. But most of them are still like in their original wrap. And there's even more on this side. It goes like all the way down, but Luckily, they didn't really destroy too much here. Next stop is Petco, and I kind of pulled some stuff out, but there's this box full of, looks like returns. There's like some bird treats. These are really cute, but these are rain boots. There's two pairs, that box is ripped open. And then also looks like some dog treats. 
they might have been opened or at least ripped. This is also dog treats. So there's a couple dog treats in here and I don't know, I have no idea what this is. Oh, it's a bird toy. It's a little bit wet, but hopefully I can save that. And in this box, there's also a dog toy. Doesn't look ripped, but dog toy. And this is a dog scooper. So that's about it here. I'm still gonna double check, but everything is pretty wet. So I got lucky with these being in boxes. They were pretty covered. I'm at a different Ulta now, and there is another suit bag, and this one is pretty big. It is leaking, which is not fun, but there's a curling wand right here, and I think I see some makeup, so it could be a good bag. I'm gonna grab it, see what we can find in there. I'm gonna double check the other side, but it looks like mostly a bunch of posters and like packaging stuff in here. There's another bag on this side, and I already checked a few, it kind of ripped open on me but it looks like a lot of the makeup is still in the box. So that could be a good sign that they didn't completely destroy everything. It looks like everything else in here is just normal trash, but luckily I have two bags, so let's go through them. I'm going through the first bag and it's looking pretty good so far. A lot of this is still in the packaging. They didn't destroy it. Only the outside got dirty, like the box, but it looks like there's a ton that they didn't actually get to. So it looks like a lot of this fresh skincare. There's like some face masks and creams, but they didn't destroy them. These are still in the boxes. And then there's stuff like this. They did pop the top off of it, but a lot of it can still be saved. This is like a face spray. Next bag has a bunch of heat tools. I think there's three different ones. They did cut the cords on them, but the cords are right here. So it's a pretty easy fix. I can definitely save these three. They didn't cut them like too crazy or anything, so that's good. Just cleaned all of the makeup up and this is what I found. So all of these were brand new in their original packaging, as well as this. They did break the top off of a few. Luckily I was able to find those ones. A couple pieces of makeup and then the heat tools in the back. They did cut the cords. They did stain a little bit. I couldn't get it, but they can definitely still be fixed. I'm checking my mall dumpster and there's a huge bag here and it's from Vans. There's a ton of shoe boxes in here. I think I'm just gonna rip it open and see what's inside. My flashlight's about to die, but it is super heavy. So fingers crossed, hopefully we can find something in here. I'm going through the boxes and this one is pretty heavy. It says worn donation and there's actually something inside. So it looks like definitely a pair of vans and they look a little bit worn but not bad and it looks like they're yeah they're the same shoe so these are definitely keepers they don't look like they're in bad condition at all okay i was about to leave but luckily i kept digging there's another box here it has a donation tag it's super heavy so let's see what's inside oh my gosh these look like they're brand new I can't believe they didn't donate these. Let me pull them out. That's insane. They still have the stuffing inside. I don't see anything wrong with them either. What? That's crazy. You can tell they're a little bit worn, but barely. Okay, I'm checking another spot at the mall and there must be a coach store here because I found a pair of coach sunglasses, but they did break them in half. They snapped that off. Maybe it can still be fixed. I did find both pieces. And then there's also this, which it looks like it might be like part of a belt or maybe a purse that they cut up, but that's all I could find in this bag. But maybe these can actually be saved. I'm checking my Big Lots dumpster. I actually had to jump in, but I did see some stuff. Like this looks like a Christmas decoration. It might be missing something, but there's that. I also see a pumpkin. Oh, so the pumpkin's missing the top, but it can still be saved. I think like you can find something to put on top and kind of cover that missing piece. There's also a ton of these sparkling ice drinks, even some food products. I'll have to check expiration dates. A huge pack of candy. And then this is... I think it's a napkin holder, but I don't see anything wrong with it. But this, I had to jump in for. I'm gonna see if I can find the missing piece. I was able to find the missing piece, but it was all the way over here and it was in this kind of dirty water. I'm gonna take it and I'm sure I can just wash it off and save it. But that is super cute. I don't know why they threw it away because 
It looks like everything's here. It doesn't look like it's broken. So it's a pretty cool find. 